We all know there is no Nobel Prize for mathematics, but there are two equivalents, Field Medal and the Abel Prize. In my opinion, Abel Prize is the equivalent to Nobel Prize in mathematics. I'll tell you why. Nobel Prize is being awarded by the King of Norway. It's pretty much the, uh, like the Nobel Prize areas. Um, we all know sciences are being awarded by Sweden and the uh, Peace Prize is being awarded by the Norway. Um, the Field Medal is being awarded by the International Mathematical Union. But uh, to get a Field Medal, you have to be under 40. Um, so for Nobel Prize, there's no age limit. You know, it's a lifetime achievement. If you are a late boomer, you cannot get a Nobel Prize uh, or, or if it were uh, under 40, because um, there are many Nobel Prize winners, they have been recognized by the achievement they did after 35 or 40. So, <coughs> Field Medal has restrictions. Having said that, Field Medal winners are the best mathematician in the world. They are smart, child prodigies, the best of the best. I should say that. But I give you some example like John Nash, who won the Abel Prize, but he never won the Prize for Field Medal. He tried hard when he was young, but he couldn't get in. Eventually, John Nash um, got the <coughs> Nobel Prize for um, uh, economics for the contribution he did for game theory. Game theory is a mathematical area, so it was heavily applicable in economics. So he, he has some mental issues, but he was not awarded the field medal when he was young. Uh, he's a super smart guy. So when you compare the Nobel Prize and the field medal and Abel Prize, the Abel Prize should be the equivalent to Nobel Prize.